You know, I do a lot of flipping and there's a lot of good flipping hooks on the market. Most of them come with keepers. And there's a lot of good keepers out there, but I like, what I like to do is I just cut that keeper off just like that. You notice this hook here, it's got a sprout, a little spike on it right there. So what I do is I take that same, same hook and I'll, I'll take and tie a uni with whatever size line you want. Now, if I'm, if I'm doing this to a flipping hook, I'm gonna use pretty good size line, you know, 20, 25 pound test and because you want a, a pretty good size keeper on there is what you're what you're looking for so this is 20 and what i do is tie a uni knot stick it right over the hook and pull it down tight right on top of that sprout so now you can pull it down as tight as you want you can have the keeper on the inside or you can spin around and you have it on the outside like traditional now that thing will not come down the shank of the hook because that sprout's holding it in place so now when you put your plastic on, you got a keeper there that you never see any part of that black plastic coming down the shank of your hook. It will not move, it cannot come down the shank of the hook. It takes about 15 to 20 seconds to do. And I'm telling you, that's the best keeper you can find right there.